In this video, you will learn how to create a new workspace in Trello. We'll cover the basics of workspaces, how to create them, as well as best practices around setting them up. Plus, you'll learn how to use multiple workspaces and how to manage them through the sidebar menu. Let's start by learning about workspaces. A Trello workspace is a way of grouping boards together to make sharing and collaborating even easier. You can think of them as a container for all of your Trello boards. All boards must be in a workspace. Workspaces can be created for free, or they can be upgraded to a paid plan for additional features. You might even have a combination of free and paid workspaces. Now, let's create a workspace. To create a new workspace, select the Create button in your Trello header. Then, select Create Workspace. Enter your workspace name. Choose a workspace type. Add a description to let members know more about your workspace. Then, select Continue. Invite some team members to your new workspace. You can also do this later. Presto! Your new workspace is created. Next, we'll discuss best practices around setting up your workspace. Workspaces are often used to group boards that are related to the same project, workflow, or team. For example, a marketing team has their own workspace. Within their workspace are boards related to their projects, meetings, and events. A workspace can also work well for a complex, cross-functional project. This workspace is set up for a large mobile app project. Within this workspace are boards related to software development, marketing, PR, and more. Plus, if you're a Trello Premium or Enterprise user, you can use Workspace Use to see everything in the project at a high level. Let's talk about using multiple workspaces. If you're an individual or a small organization, we recommend starting with a single workspace. This helps keep your work simplified. However, you can always create additional workspaces if needed. If you're just looking for ways to group boards together, you can create a single workspace and use board collections to organize your work. Board collections are a premium and enterprise feature. Large organizations with multiple business units may want to consider using multiple workspaces. If you're new to Trello, take some time to strategize how to set up those workspaces before you create anything. For example, consider if you want to set up workspaces based on projects, teams, locations, etc. This will save you time in the future. Once you create a workspace, you can manage it through the sidebar menu. You can collapse and expand the sidebar menu by selecting the arrow icon on the left side of the screen. Let's take a look at the options available to you. The boards page shows all of the boards associated with your workspace that are visible to you. Admins of premium and enterprise workspaces can see all boards, even if they're private and you're not a member. The members page shows all Trello members that are in your workspace, along with their permission level. Under settings, you'll find several options. The Workspace Settings page is where Workspace admins can change the workspace visibility. The Export page is available to Premium and Enterprise members. Admins can export workspaces to CSV or JSON format from this page. The Billing page is available to admins on a paid plan. You can manage your billing details on this page. And finally, the Power Ups page shows you all of the Power Ups enabled on your workspace boards.